the single one litre liner. For this, you will need one one litre standard canister, one one litre standard blacktop liner, and a one metre length of non disposable yellow vacuum tubing kit. Start by placing the one litre canister into the wall bracket. Take note of the vacuum port and then the patient port. These are unique and cannot be misconnected. Place the black lid liner into the canister and press home firmly. Connect the black vacuum tapered connector into the vacuum port located on the liner lid. Turn on the vacuum and place your finger over the patient port located on the lid of the liner, ensuring a vacuum is present. Connect the patient tubing to the patient port located on the lid of the liner. The unit is now ready for use. Once the liner is full, and with the vacuum still turned on, remove the patient tubing, twist off the black cap located on the front edge of the liner top, and insert firmly into the patient port. Remove the vacuum tapered connector from the top of the liner, remembering that there is no requirement to cap off the vacuum port. This is due to the hydrophobic filter located within the liner itself. Using the convenient handles located at the sides of the liner, remove the liner from the canister. The Vaxax Bacticlear antimicrobial liner stands upright when full of fluid for convenient and safe disposal. The single 2 litre liner. For this you will need one 2 litre standard canister, one 2 litre standard black top liner, note the vacuum port and then the patient port. These are unique and cannot be misconnected, and a one metre length of non-disposable yellow vacuum tubing kit. Start by placing the two litre canister into the wall bracket. Place the black lid liner into the canister and press home firmly. Connect the black vacuum tapered connector into the vacuum port located on the liner lid. Set the vacuum to maximum, turn on and inflate the liner fully within the canister. Place your finger over the patient port located on the lid of the liner, ensuring a vacuum is present. Connect the patient tubing to the patient port located on the lid of the liner. The unit is now ready for use. When the liner is full, and with the vacuum still turned on, remove the patient tubing, twist off the black cap located on the front edge of the liner top, and insert firmly into the patient port. Remove the vacuum taper connector from the top of the liner, remembering that there is no requirement to cap off the vacuum port. This is due to the hydrophobic filter located within the liner itself. Using the convenient handles located at the sides of the liner, remove the liner from the canister. The Vaxax Bacticlear antimicrobial liner stands upright when full of fluid for convenient and safe disposal. The single 3 litre liner. For this, you will need one 3 litre canister with rear vacuum port, one 3 litre liner, noting first the vacuum port and then the patient port. These are unique and cannot be misconnected a one metre length of non-disposable yellow vacuum tubing kit with T-piece. Taking the yellow vacuum tubing, insert the vacuum T-piece connector located within the tubing kit itself and press firmly into the port situated at the back of the canister. Start by placing the three litre canister into the wall bracket. Place the three litre liner into the canister, then to inflate the liner within the canister Turn on the vacuum to high and place your finger over the end of the tapered connector located at the end of the non-disposable yellow vacuum tubing. The liner inflates. Connect the black vacuum tapered connector into the vacuum port located on the liner lid. Place your finger over the patient port located on the lid of the liner, ensuring a vacuum is present. Connect the patient tubing to the patient port. 
the suction unit is now ready for use. When the liner is full and ensuring the vacuum is turned on, twist off the black cap located on the front edge of the liner and insert it into the patient port. Remove the vacuum tapered connector from the top of the liner, remembering that there is no requirement to cap off the vacuum port. This is due to the hydrophobic filter located within the liner itself. Using the convenient handles located at the sides of the liner, remove the liner from the canister. The Vaxax Bacticlear antimicrobial liner stands upright when full of fluid for convenient and safe disposal. The Bacticlear 2 litre ward liner. For this you will need one 2 litre Bacticlear ward canister with rear vacuum port. One 2 litre Bacticlear ward liner with a unique smooth surface for ease of cleaning. Note first the patient port and then the vacuum port. These are unique and cannot be misconnected. Taking the yellow non-disposable vacuum tubing, insert the T-piece vacuum connector located within the tubing kit itself and press firmly into the port situated at the back of the canister. Start by placing the 2-litre canister into the wall bracket. Place the back to clear liner into the canister and press home firmly. Connect the black vacuum tapered connector into the vacuum port located on the liner lid. Turn on the vacuum to high and inflate the liner within the canister. Place your finger over the patient port located on the lid of the liner ensuring a vacuum is present. Connect the patient tubing to the patient port. The suction unit is now ready for use. Once the liner is full, and with the vacuum still turned on, remove the patient tubing, twist off the black cap located on the front edge of the liner top, and insert firmly into the patient port. Remove the vacuum tapered connector from the top of the liner, remembering that there is no requirement to cap off the vacuum port. This is due to the hydrophobic filter located within the liner itself. Using the convenient handles located at the sides of the liner, remove the liner from the canister. The Vaxax Bacticlear antimicrobial liners stand upright when full of fluid for convenient and safe disposal.